Hey guys, it's Charlotte and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. So today we are picking up the camera and we are going to be vlogging for the first time in like a whole year. Um, I decided to pick it up because Saturday I, well this Saturday particularly, I don't really have anything planned and I just wanted to try to see if I can vlog. I'm a little shy when it comes to like vlogging in public and everything. And I just wanted to do it. So today I actually have my happy planner. Um, and this is not sponsored or anything, but look, it's a Disney theme. And I actually got this as a gift from one of my coworkers as a secret Santa. And I have a lot of stuff to do. So look how aesthetically pleasing this is. I wrote down everything that I possibly could every single day starting in January. And I have been keeping track. I've been doing so good. Um, and look, look at this. And I track my, if I spend any money, my workouts and how much water um, intake that I have every single day. Um, but today we have a couple of things that we are wanting to do. So the stuff that I've already done today is promote my Saturday video. Um, we did a stuffing video. We did $490 stuffing into my cash envelopes and to my sinking funds. If you have not seen that, that was on Saturday and I will link that at the end of the video. So you guys can go and watch that. Um, I continue to wash clothes. I started on Friday. I just finished. I meal planned for the rest, rest of the week for next week. I took my vitamins, which I always have to take my vitamins. I took a probiotic and a multivitamin or a prenatal vitamin. Um, so the other things that we are going to do today is we have to shop for a birthday gift for one of my friends whose kid is turning one years old. Um, and just look at some fun things. Um, we need to fold clothes today. We have to relax because if I don't write relax on my planner, then I will not do it. I will just go 90 to nothing and not stop and just chill. Um, we want to finish reading the book that I've been reading. I think the book that I'm reading currently is called Emergency Contact, which I'll show you later in the video. Um, we need to clean the kitchen, the table, and the living room. And then I did write down a vlog question mark. I have to send a package off, which is already in the mailbox. Uh, we have to upload on eBay. Uh, let's see. I want to create some challenges on Canva. We are going to work out. We're going to go walking, which... Guys, it is like 34 degrees right now. With the wind, it is it feels like 25 degrees. And my Alabama self cannot take this cold. I love the cold. I really do. Um, but feeling like it's 25 degrees, I can't do it. I never wear beanies. Um, I never layer. <laughs> so this is, this is just not for me. And I feel like I'm getting sick because I woke up with a horrible cough. And I am trying to take medicine, so I will be really mad if I get sick for the third time during winter. Um, what are some other things that we have to do today? Um, we are going to, what I said, we're going to go work out, which involves going walking today. Um, I do play Pokemon on my phone, so we are going to go, it might be too cold, but I'm going to try to go and walk the nature trails um, close by to where I live. And the event for Pokemon is three hours long. So, and I did not work out yesterday, which sucks. Um, but I really do want to work out today. So we're going to go walking later on. So currently we're going to go to the mall. And we're going to go to TJ Maxx because I want to go to TJ Maxx. And we'll just see what happens today. I have not vlogged in a year, so... Um, my goal for 2024 is to start vlogging a little bit more, but also I want to, um, have some me days. So this is my me day, just me going out and doing stuff that I like to do. And that's pretty much it. So we're going to go, we're about a 45, not a 45 minute drive, probably about a 30 minute drive to our destination. And it is currently 1044. So the mall's already open. It's an outdoor mall. Um, we're going to park close to where the stores are so I don't have to walk in the cold. Um, but anyway, so yeah, so come with me today and let's see what we have planned, um, for this vlog. All right, you guys, so we are here at the mall. We are heading to TJ Maxx, um, and we are planning on buying the birthday gifts here. And also, you know I'm like a planner. So apparently my brother and my two nephews are actually going to be here as well. 
well um, in about 40 minutes or so. So I was not planning on seeing them today, but since they are going to be at the mall today, um, I plan on going to see them, hang out with them, um, and it's going to be really fun. They only come to this mall because there's a store here that you can buy Pokemon cards, and they love Pokemon cards. Um, they love collecting them, my nephews, especially like the shiny Tarzars and everything. So yeah, so we're going to walk into TJ Maxx and see what we can do. I'm probably not going to buy anything for myself because I'm the kind of person that will buy for everybody else and not me because I am also picky. Um, but yeah, so let's see what we can find. Okay, guys, so I found two things for somebody that I'm not going to um, announce, but I found this. It's Nine West. It was originally $24.99 and is on clearance for $12, you guys. And it comes with a purse and a little keychain. And I think that this would be a really good birthday or if you are starting Christmas shopping already in January, um, this would be a perfect, perfect gift. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to use it for. Maybe Mother's Day, maybe a birthday, and maybe a Christmas. Don't know yet, but I'm going to go ahead and snag this. And then I actually picked up this one as well. This is a Steve Madden and it's a wallet and you get a scarf as well. This was $24.99 and it is currently on clearance for $12. Um, I think this is super cute and again you can use it for like Mother's Day, for birthdays, for Christmas, anything like that. So $12, $24 from $12. There was a lot of people in there, so I felt very uncomfortable to film. Um, I did show you two of the things that I did get, and I am going to show you another thing that I got. It is very cold outside, but I'm trying to walk to my car, drop this stuff off, and then I will show you what I got. My brother and my nephews have just pulled up, so we are going to go to Columbia, because he said he needed a belt or something, and they're having a separate off, so I'm going Let me get in the car. We're not getting in the car, but drop this stuff off. And I'll show you what I got. I only got picked up one more thing. Um, but yeah, hold on a second. Okay, so as you can see, I did pick up the uh, Steve Madden. It was $24 and I paid $12 for it. it. Comes with a wallet and a scarf. So I picked this one up and that was in the clip as well. And then I picked up, let me see if I can get it. The Nine West purse, this was $24.99 as well, and I only paid $12, so it's a purse, and it has a little keychain, um, super cute. I don't know who I'm going to gift this to, but it's going to be a great gift for whoever receives it. And then last but not least, I did pick up this cute dress for my friend. Um, I thought it was super cute. It's a 24 month. It was $14.99, and it was $8. Um, I thought it was super cute. She can use it later on in the year during christmas and everything um it's a little sad and i'm i don't know it's a little bittersweet when i go and shop for baby clothes because one i can spoil my nieces and nephew and then two it's like i really do want to buy stuff for my own kid um but of course that's not happening right now and it's a little sad, but it's okay. We will get through it. Um, so yeah, so I got those three items. I spent $35. So the next place that we're going to go to is the Plain Talk. We did already go to Columbia and he bought like a belt. My brother did. Um, so I actually drove a little bit further away from the store that we're going to because I actually have to go pee. Um, and the bathroom's nearby. So there it is right there, Plain Talk. It's actually a pretty good store cool store. Um, hopefully I can video in and get some footage of some of the cute things, not cute things, but some of the fun things that are so there. So I think I'm going to show you guys a look at these dice. So these are basically for D&D, but I just bought those dice right there for um, budgeting and to like roll the dice and I'm just going to use it for budgeting for some reason. Don't know. You want to get, oh, get some video cards? Look, he has his little Fanny pack. <laughs> Pokemon? Yeah, you gonna get Pokemons? 
Look, here's one. Why don't you get this one? This one's cool. This one just came out, apparently. That's what Uncle Jared said. I don't have any. Oh, I'm sorry. You should have brought $120 then. How much do you have? 80? 70. But I want this Taylor Swift guitar that's signed and it has the certificate and everything in it for only $1,199.99. Like, that's goals. But I cannot spend that much money on a guitar that's signed, even though I am an obsessed Taylor Swift fan. Jeremy, what are you going to get? Hmm, I don't know. Are you going to get Pokemon cards too? Little little Lily's gonna give you some money so you can buy a card. What is it? <laughs> Alright guys, so we are back in the car and I am starving. So we are going to stop at McDonald's. You know, this is just a treat myself day and I haven't had McDonald's in forever. So we are there's a glare on my on my glasses. So I'm gonna take these off while I'm waiting to order. Um, so I haven't had McDonald's in a while and I really, really want a hot and spicy chicken. I was gonna get fries, but I think I'm gonna pass on the fries and just get a hot and spicy chicken with a small Coke. And I haven't had a Coke in a while. And I'm actually getting a migraine and I really don't need coffee. Um, so we're going to fuel our caffeine or fuel our headache with some caffeine. Um, so yeah, so I am waiting. I have never been to this McDonald's before. It's pretty much down the road from my house. Um, so we are going to Orchard and we're going to try it. Hopefully, hopefully it still tastes good. And I just wanted to let y'all know that filming and vlogging today, I have noticed a big difference in like my face. My face has gotten a lot slimmer um, ever since I started this weight loss journey which I can see the difference it's incredible and I'm just super proud of myself but today is a cheat day and we are going to treat ourselves with a hot and spicy which I already looked up on my fitness pal and you get 15 grams of protein which is really good um, I can't remember how much grams of protein was my breakfast this morning but I have to do that um, but yeah 15 grams of protein from the hot and spicy and we will walk it off today, so I'm not worried about it. Um, but yeah, so I'm super excited about that, and I'm just waiting to order. We're gonna get started for you. Hey, um, can I have a hot and spicy, add pickles, just the sandwich, okay. and, and a small Coke? All right, what up, y'all? That's all. Four seventy-seven at first one now. Okay, thank you. So $4.77 for a hot and spicy add pickles and a small Coke. So yay, I'm super excited. Okay, so we got the goods. We got the hot and spicy add pickles and then we got the Coke. We're going to try the Coke first. I'm still in the McDonald's parking lot because I do not want to film and drive because I think that is very unsafe. Um, so we have the Coke, which is spilling over. So good, you guys. Oh my god. That hits the spot. And I did get a small Coke. Um, sorry about the weird, like, angles of my phone. Of my, um, yeah, of my phone. Because I did get this. Jared bought me this. But the little sticky part keeps coming off. I don't know if my phone is too heavy. I don't know if um, it needs to be on a flatter surface. So I have no idea. Um, so let's try the hot and spicy. I am starving. Like, oh my gosh, it is 122 right now. Um, so let's try it. And I did order with pickles, so it kind of looks like that. It has a lot of mayonnaise on the side, but I'm okay with that. I like mayonnaise. Mayonnaise is not the best for you, but it's good. Okay, so first bite. Super good. I have mayonnaise on my face, but super good. Hits the spot. Great lunch. Um, but yeah, so 
the plan for right now is I'm going to go home. I'm going to take my dogs out. I'm probably going to relax for a little bit um, and then go outside. And I'm probably going to go, instead of the nature walk, I'm probably going to go to another outdoor mall, which is super close to me, that we play Pokemon. And I think it's about a mile and a half long, or maybe a mile long whenever you um, walk the whole perimeter of the mall. So that's the plan. And it's only because since it's cold, if I get cold, I can just go and walk into like Barnes and Noble or Hallmark and look at that. But I do want to go to Hallmark because I really think that their Hallmark ornaments are 75% off, which is really good for me as a reseller that I can buy as many Hallmark ornaments and then resell it um, for a little bit more. And that's what I did last year and it's actually pretty good. Um, I did resell a lot of the ornaments from there. And so I'm gonna do it again this year. So hopefully it dropped down to 75% off. At the beginning of January, it was still 50% or the day after Christmas, it was 50% off. So I have not been back since then. So we shall see. Um, so I'm probably gonna finish the sandwich and then head home and do all of that stuff. And then we'll go to the mall and we will see what we can get there. Anyways, I'll see you in a few. Okay guys, so I just got to the mall and there is a ton of cars. Um, this is a very popular place on Saturdays and it's also a popular place to play Pokemon because it's a pretty decent sized mall and everything. It has like a ton of like Pokestops and everything. I'm pretty sure I am like going over y'all's heads over that. Um, but yeah, so... I don't know how much I'm going to film, but I also cannot film and play Pokemon at the same time because I am on my phone. I do plan on going to Barnes & Noble. There's Barnes & Noble, Kirkland's, and Hallmark. I'm definitely going to go to Barnes & Noble. I do have a $25, am, not Amazon gift card, $25 um, Barnes & Noble gift card that Jared got me for Christmas. So I'm going to see if there is a book that I want to buy. I shouldn't buy books because um, I have a ton of books that I need to read. Um, but I also want to go to Hallmark because I did mention about the 75% off sale. So hopefully that is a thing. But anyways, so that is it. And let's, let's go and see. So I'm currently in Barnes and Noble and they are having like a huge 50% off book sale. The only book that I found is this one is The Christmas Pig by J.K. Rowling. If you don't know who J.K. Rowling is, um, she's best known for Harry Potter. I absolutely love Harry Potter. Um, I dressed up as Harry Potter at a Comic Con and also dressed up as Dobby at a Comic Con. My dog is named Dobby. So I absolutely love Harry Potter. Um, I've heard of this book, but I'm probably not going to get it. It's 50% off of $25, which is going to be like $12.50. Don't know if I want to just use my gift card on it, but I mean, I'm not like dying to read this. It's probably going to be a good book because it's written by her. But I don't know. Um, other than that, I don't really see anything that I need or want. So we're probably just going to go to Hallmark next and see if we're going to find something over there to read. So I said I wasn't going to get coffee, but I did. I got a hot because it is very cold outside. So we're going to head over to Hallmark and see if there is any ornaments that are on clearance that we can buy and resell. You guys, it is so freaking cold right now. You can see like my nose is red, but I walked for, I gotta stop my timer, for 20 minutes around the mall and I could not bear it anymore. So I'm just going to go home and get warm because I, I just can't do it. If I had maybe my beanie back on and a scarf and some gloves, I think I could probably make it. But being that I am having a cough today, um, I don't want to chance it and get worse. But I did buy some stuff at Hallmark. It was very quiet. I was the only customer in there. So I really just didn't want to film. Hallmark, I got three ornaments. Their sale was 75% off. And I got, the first one is this Mickey 100 Years. 
Originally, it was $30 and I spent $7.35. I'm not sure if I'm going to resell this. I have not looked up the sold comps on this one. But given that it's Disney, it probably is going to sell sometime this year because it's not marked as like a 2023 ornament. Um, but yeah, so it's just Mickey with the director chair and then it has um, the little film cassette and it has the different characters at the bottom. Um, this was $30, like I said, and only paid $7.35. And then the next item, there wasn't really a lot to choose from. There was a lot of generic um, ornaments, which I don't really pick up those. I pretty much just look for like Disney theme, like really name brand themes whenever I'm looking at ornaments or Hallmark ornaments. Um, so the next two things is the same thing. So these are the Jasmine. They are the itty bitty ones. And they retail for $9.99. And I got both of them uh, for $2.35 each. I did not check the sold comps again for these. But since it's Disney, I'm pretty sure it is going to sell at least for like $10 or so. Um, but yeah, so I picked up two of them. There was a lot more. So probably next weekend, I'll probably pick up some more because I know that these will definitely sell. Um, I'm actually almost out of my mini one that I bought last year I bought I think I bought like six of them and only have one left and it was the small one so I am most likely going to come back next week and pick up some more but yeah two dollars and 35 cents so total I have picked let's see I paid 13 dollars and 41 cents so 735 for the 100 years of the Mickey and then 245 for the Jasmine I also have a $5 coupon that starts in March, and I think I got one in the mail as well that starts in February, so I'm pretty sure I can use it on the ornaments, so if I do, then I can just use that and um, get it for a little bit cheaper, <laughs> but anyways, so that is it for the haul. We're going to go home. I'm probably going to end the video soon. Um, I'm probably going to show you guys what I'm going to upload on eBay and I think that's it because for the rest of the day, it's going to be just a chill night. It is currently 352. Um, but yeah, so there's not really much going to happen for the rest of the night. So let's just get home and then I will show you the eBay of what I'm going to upload tonight. Um, but yeah, so I will see you guys at home. Hey guys, so we are back at the house and the lighting sucks. I am currently in my office and the sun is pretty much going down. It gets it gets dark around 5.30 and it's 4.23 right now. Um, but I wanted to come on here before I end the video and let you guys know that I will be uploading four items on eBay. That is on our to-do list for today, which I showed you guys earlier in the video of my um, happy planner that I've been using. So the rest of the day, I still have to fold clothes. I already read a couple of, couple of chapters, but I want to finish the book. Um, I need to unpack some books to put it on my new bookshelf that I that Jared and I like painted and stained and everything it was pretty cool. Uh, I need to create some challenges on Canva, and then I still need to clean my kitchen, dining room table, and living room, um, and still need to upload stuff on eBay. So the four items that I'm going to upload on eBay, and the link will be down below. Um, I don't really promote my eBay store on YouTube. Um, I just don't know why. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to show you the four items that I'm going to be listing today, which is Saturday, so you will not see this until Sunday. Um, so the first thing is these Kirkling salt and pepper ornaments. Now, Christmas does sell for me year round. Um, I think it sells year round for a lot of people, but it does for me as well. So these Kirkland's um, salt and pepper ornaments, they are super cute. I got this at the Goodwill for $2. Um, and then, then the next one is this stocking hanger. It's the Santa Claus one. I just uploaded a snowman one last week. Um, and I got this at the Goodwill as well, the same as this one, um, for $2 and just $2, I believe. But yeah, so it's pretty heavy and it's a Kirkland brand as well. Um, and it is just a snowman holding a little reef with a little stocking and it's just a stocking holder. Um, like I said, that was $2. Um, the next one is this Dark Vader Scentsy Buddy. 
Um, I'm not going to take it out of the box, but I got this at a Goodwill for $3, like perfect condition, no staining or anything. Um, it also has like the little Scentsy beads that comes. I don't, I don't own a Scentsy Buddy, so I have no idea what it is, but it comes with the Scentsy Buddy and it also came with the little Scentsy packs. Um, but yeah, so I got this for $3 at the Goodwill. Um, I think this roughly will sell for about $15 on Amazon, not Amazon, on eBay. <laughs> I don't know why I have Amazon on my brain today. Um, last but not least is going to be this Bath and Body Work Everlasting Magic Summer or Shimmer Fizz Body Lotion. I don't use Bath and Body products except for like their candles and stuff. Um, but I got this at a gift for Christmas and I don't use it. I won't use it. Brand new, never been used. So I am going to upload this as well. Um, I don't know what it smells like, so, and I don't plan on smelling it because certain smells do give me a migraine and I don't plan on, um, trying that and triggering my migraines. Um, so those are the four items that I'm going to be listing today. I'm going to list four more items tomorrow on Sunday. Um, so you're just going to have to check out my store. Um, I'm like out of breath because I'm so tired. Um, I had to take the dogs out. And that is very exhausting when I have to take the dogs out because they like to just run around and tangle me up in their leashes. But anyways, um, so those are the four items. This is what I'm currently reading right now. This is the Emergency Contact by Mary H.K. Cho. It's pretty good. It's like 300 pages. I'm on page 235 of this book. I started it last week. Um, I really want to finish it so I can start probably a Colleen Hoover book. But I'm not sure. I have like three totes in my garage that I need to empty and go through and get rid of. Um, but yeah, so that is the plan for today is upload on eBay, make some challenges, read, and just pretty much just relax. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys like this video. I haven't vlogged in like a year, so we'll see how the final cut goes. Um, if you would like to see more of these vlogs, let me know. I'm probably not going to do it like every week or every other week it might be just a monthly thing um because i'm not just gonna film just because just to make a video i want to film because um something interesting is happening or just a day in the life like today we went to the mall and did some other things um we pretty much just did a me day um but yeah so let me know if you guys want to see more of these videos if not totally fine not gonna hurt my feelings but anyways, I love you guys and thank you guys so much for all of your love and support. Be sure to subscribe if you are not subscribed to my channel yet. And I will see you guys, I think if this uploads on Sunday, I will see you guys on Monday for a mini challenge. Bye guys.